<laughs> Super fun. Hey guys, it's Robin, and I had an awesome time this week at New York Toy Fair, and I'm gonna have a bunch of videos, so make sure you hit that subscribe button if you want to see all the cool stuff that I saw. So today I want to show you the awesome stuff I got to bring home with me. <laughs> toy Fair is just so much fun, and it just never ends. So I have these two big bags here next to me filled with toys. They're a little messed up because I had to like repurpose um, things to get them compacted into bags to get them home to New Jersey so like I had stuff organized by brand but not anymore so let's start with my friend here my Barbie how cool is she oh my gosh she is one of the fashionistas the fashionistas were so cool always one of my favorite things to see at Toy Fair um I love her flocked hair though oh my gosh she is so cool and I got her at the Women in Toys event, and she's from Mattel, so thank you so much, Women in Toys. <laughs> Here are some. Ooh, my nieces are going to really love these. They are Shopkins stickers. These are from Moose. Pop-up stickers, they're called. Well, I guess they, like, stand up a little. Ooh, cute. Oh, yeah, look. <laughs> oh, cute. They're going to love those. All right. I'm sorry, there is no rhyme or reason to this. So, from Epic, Calico Critters had a big relaunch of their brand, and here is one of the new little cuties. This is so adorable. So, very fancy. I took lots of pictures of those guys. I think this is from Women in Toys as well. I have a fingerling. This one is, what is your name? It just says Baby Monkey. Um, but I know I have one and then someone else gave me one of theirs. So I think I have two of them here somewhere. Yay, I got a purple monkey. I love purple. So very cute. Also from the Women in Toys event and um, also from Wowie. And it wants one of the year. Okay, I'm very interested to see what this is. It is one of the Line Friends, which we have a cool Line Friends store here in New York City. Um, it got a little smashed in my suitcase. It's a port portable fan. How cute is that? Um, and I think this was for McDonald's for some kind of toy, but this is adorable. And if it's a portable fan, I'm all about that because I am 40. <laughs> Said to get a little warm. Okay, these were also from Women in Toys. It's a Ray. I do not have the Ray Jakku doll, so I'm very excited about that. I'm just throwing things on the floor, making a big mess. Also from the Women in Toys, it's a Lego kit. It's like one of these cool starter kits with lots of different Legos. That's so awesome. I love playing with Lego and hopefully I can make some fun stuff. Oh, which speaking of, maybe I can use it with my makeup tape from Zuru. This stuff is so cool. You can make scenes and have little um, roads and bridges and all kinds of fun ways to display your Lego minifigs and other collectibles, I think, also work on, on this as well. It's awesome. This is from Mattel. It is a Mega Constructs Pokemon Mimi Q. I don't know who that character is, but they had all kinds of really cool Pokemon characters from the Mega Constructs line. That was really awesome. <laughs> I got this really cool orb squishy ball. Uh, I was just walking around with this. Because it can be a little stressful at Toy Fair. It's a lot of walking. A lot of stuff to do. Squishies. Orb, speak, orb makes the, some of the best squishies. The soft and so, slow squishy line is so awesome. <laughs> Just toss that. Um, oh, very excited about this. This was in my goodie bag from Women in Toys. And it is a Ben and Holly storybook. Which my nieces are all about. Ben and Holly, Peppa. They even talk with adorable little British accents. They're so cute. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. And someone gave me this one. These are from Mattel. They are called Fizzy Tongues. And this one is a unicorn. <laughs> that is so funny. Do these open up? Uh, there's just a Velcro, I guess, to change batteries or something. Um, but these are pretty fun. <laughs> and this, this one was in my bag. This one is a little more of a monster. That is so funny. 
Um, my cousin is having a baby and she will be getting these for her <laughs> kid and <laughs> I think they'll have a lot of fun with that along with this from also from Fisher Price <laughs> fidgety cube how cool is that it just kind of shows you that we're all really children because people of all ages are obsessed with fidget cubes and you know this is amazing this is perfect my first fidget cube it's called like that's hilarious speaking of fidget cubes too I got an awesome fidget cube from Zuru how cool is this if I can open this um it is baby Groot how cute is this so it's a fidget cube but they put a face on it and it kind of just takes the place of the spinning face like the little turn wheel but how cute is that they have some Marvel licenses and I think DC and I love fidget cubes I could just sit here and play with this light switchy thing all day find them very satisfying Fruit is gonna go on my shelf here. Um, so cool. Oh, here's my other thing going. It's a sparkly one. I'm so excited about this. They come with little blankets. They're so cute. Oh, just making a mess. Oh, I got some Hatchimals. The new Hatchimals collectibles are so cute. I'm gonna be doing a blind bag video. Um, and I'll open all the blind bags that I got, including this. Jurassic Park mini action dino from Mattel. The Hatchimals are from Spin Master, by the way. This is from Wicked Cool. It is a headband um, earphone thing. I wonder if this works with Bluetooth because I've been wanting some kind of Bluetooth headband to like use at night. Oh, no, it's not Bluetooth. It has speakers, but it's supposed to be a little more comfortable. I wonder if it'll fit on my round head. I don't think it's going to fit my round head. But these are really cool. And super soft. And it's, you know, it's great for nighttime. Ooh. Zuru sent me home with some Avengers bunch of balloons. That is super fun. Oh, and there's another fidget cube. <gasps> Love this. These, they make such cool patterns on these. That's awesome. Um, ooh, a Roblox. These are from Jazzwares. This, I believe, was in the um, goodie bag from Women and Toys, along with these gazillion bubbles. These are the best bubbles ever, gazillion bubbles. Who is the company on this? Funrise, yes. They make awesome, awesome bubble toys. That's funny. We had a really warm day out. It would have been great for playing that. Um, here's two little books. They're from Creata as well. DK Reads. Um, like A Year on a Farm and Little Dolphin. My nieces will love those. Add it to the pile. <laughs> these are so cool. These are twisty pets. These are from Spin Master. And everybody was talking about these. There are these little characters. There's all kinds of animals. And they even did some ones that were blinged out with like crystals. They look so cool. So you can turn it into a little bracelet. How cool is that? I have, I don't, oh, that's so cute. I'm going to have to try these out. That's so awesome. Got another Hatchimal from Spin. Oh, these are cool. Metal Earth makes these really cool kits that you can build your own little, um, I don't know how to open this box. So you can build your own little creations. And I went over there because they had these really cool things like um, My Little Pony and the TARDIS and Star Wars stuff. So they gave me this one to check out. Let's see what it is. Ooh. And it's like all these little flat metal pieces that you kind of put together like a puzzle. It looks very challenging. <laughs> oh, cool. Look at this guy. It's a car. You see that? How cool is that? It's all made out of like flat metal pieces, even the wheels. That's pretty awesome. This one is called the UNSC Warthog. I don't know what that means, but I'm gonna put them on my shelf because it's cool. I'm gonna go here with Batgirl. That's pretty awesome. I got these creepy Chucky stickers from uh, Mexico. Fun fact, my nickname in high school was Chucky. <laughs> uh, oh, here's a new game from Mattel, from Mattel Games. It's Uno called Dose. <laughs> it's like a spin on the Uno game, 
but I guess the number two, and it's funny, it's the world's number two card game. That sounds really fun. This is really cute. It is a little Boba Fett. These are called Race and Crash Battle Rollers, and they kind of move side to side. And here we have Boba Fett and Slave One. That's cute, and they make a bunch of different ones. That's fun. Just playing with it in the package is fun. <laughs> these are also really awesome. I'm gonna be sharing these with my nieces as well from the Women in Toy. Oh no, these were from, I think Mattel gave these to us. They're from Mattel, no matter what. They're Barbie um, Crayola fashions, tie-dye fashions. How cool is that? And this one is rainbow design, and you can color your Barbie outfit, and because it's Crayola, you could probably wash it and redo it. Um, not really sure, but that sounds really cool. I know my nieces love coloring, and they love their Barbie, so we're going to have to play with that one. There is a Thomas Rosie train in here. That's cute. Girls love the little trains, too. I'll just give them that. Ooh, a Smashers from Zuru. These are really fun to open. My friend Mommy and I opened these up on Kids Toy Surprise. You should check that out. Um, that is awesome. I'm going to have that in my video. Oh, cool. It's a cutie car. Ooh, it's a kissy cab. Oh, my gosh. These are so cute. This is from Moose. Oh, my gosh. Adorable. It's a little kitty cat. That's so cute. Oh, and from Mattel, I have an Enchantimals. I don't have any Enchantimals dolls, you guys, and I just think they're so cute. This one is Karina Koala. Do a little koala, buddy. Oh, they're so cute. And there's a guy coming out with a hedgehog pet, and they both have glasses. It's so cute. This is from Zuru as well. Five surprise. Very cool. Oh, and I got a Pick Me Pop from Moose. Very excited. Oh my gosh, there's so much. I didn't look at all of this, apparently. Ooh, Shopkins, 40 stickers. That will be fun for the kids. Um, there's also Shopkins Band-Aids. And, ooh, a Season 10 Wild Style. No, these are Season 9 Wild Style. I haven't opened those up yet either. I already looked at that. <laughs> I have some Monopoly money. It's Toy Fair Monopoly money. <laughs> a grocery gang. To open up their toilets now of course because everything is about potty also i opened this up already it's an lol <laughs> it's a pen. oh these are cute it's shopkins pens or are they markers oh, oh no they're pens oh these are mine i'm not sharing those oh my gosh that's a little pez dispenser that is super cute and a little Wonder Ball with ooh, chocolate and the prize inside. These were also, I don't know what the name of this was, but these were in our Mattel goodie bag. And I know they had a display up front with these. So I'll show you how this goes. There's this weird pair of glasses. Weird, right? And then you get like a little finger here. I'm Miss Robin. <laughs> These are actually really funny. Hello. Oh, look, you can make them. <laughs> okay, I'll try to find out what these are called and I'll put in the name. This is super fun. I had no idea how fun that was going to be. That's hilarious. Oh my gosh, that is super fun. <laughs> I am so easily entertaining. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's so much cool stuff coming out this year from Toy Fair. I'm so thankful to Moose, Spin, Mattel, Zuru, Women in Toys for all these goodies. Ah! I'm going to have to review some of these really soon. And I'm going to be doing a blind bag video. And maybe I'll show some of the smaller toys too in another video as well. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you'll hit that subscribe button, especially if you love toys and tiny toys and collectibles and all this fun stuff. Oh, and Star Wars. So thanks so much for watching. Thanks for being awesome. Bye!